John Steele, Truth, Lies, and Advertising, The Art of Account Planning. Dive into the fascinating world of account planning in the advertising industry with the book, Truth, Lies, and Advertising, The Art of Account Planning, by John Steele. Learn about the crucial role of the account planner in understanding consumer needs and finding creative solutions for client problems. Discover the importance of in-depth research, effective communication with the creative team, and creating a comfortable environment that fosters genuine information from focus group participants. Embark on a journey to understand how creative briefings act as a bridge between research and brilliant ad campaigns, and the art of balancing client feedback with innovative ideas. The Crucial Role of an Account Planner in Next Level Advertising Advertising is often seen as untrustworthy and unethical, but some ad agencies aim to connect with their audiences on a human level. An account planner is responsible for conducting in-depth research into the consumer's needs to solve client problems. They work with the creative team to communicate the client's needs and ideas to develop next-level advertising that resonates with the target consumers. The account planner should ideally work with three clients at a time, max, to ensure in-depth research and attention to detail. Through this crucial role, Ad agencies can establish lasting relationships with clients and create a profitable portfolio. The Art of Asking Questions Effective communication between creatives and clients requires good listening skills and asking the right questions. This is especially important when conducting focus groups to gather accurate and useful information. It is essential to create a comfortable environment for test participants and avoid one-answer questions. Interviewing style should be non-threatening, and participants should be given a way to participate and express their views. Planning and executing creative briefs effectively is the most crucial aspect of an account planner's job. Crafting a compelling creative brief Crafting a creative brief involves synthesizing consumer research to develop an overall campaign strategy presented to the creative team. A compelling brief should address business problems, identify specific campaign objectives, target audiences, and include concrete knowledge about consumers. The most critical part is the proposition, which is the core message conveyed in one simple sentence. An effective brief should also provide entertaining ideas to communicate the proposition, leveraging insights gained from research. One example of this is the Cuervo Focus Group, where the participants' body language conveyed that Cuervo equaled party and was used as a supporting anecdote in the creative brief, which had the proposition, a party waiting to happen. From creative brief to campaign, a peek into the ad agency's world. The summary discusses the process of generating creative ideas from the client's brief to the final version of the campaign. In the ad agency's world, creating a campaign involves a laborious process of ideas generation and refinement. Starting from the creative brief, the author shows us how the creative team fine-tunes preliminary ideas and infuses them with a distinctive flair. For instance, using the Sega account research as an example, the author compared using Sega's console to playing baseball in the major league and created the phrase, Welcome to the Next Level, as the tagline. The author emphasizes that it's a collaborative process and involves testing consumer response and incorporating feedback from the client. The story of the Foster Farms account highlights the intricacies of the ideation process in the ad world. The creative team developed a commercial showing chicken puppets driving to California, but the client wasn't pleased with the alcohol and nicotine props used in the initial concept. In response, the creatives came up with two new concepts and improved the original by replacing the beer and cigarettes with junk food. Despite the team's effort, it was actually the puppet chicken commercial that tested well with focus groups, leading to its final approval. The author stresses that an account planner's job is not just limited to following the client's instructions but also finding solutions that win them over. To conclude, the author gives us a peek into the creative world of ad agencies, highlighting the collaborative and iterative nature of campaign's ideation process. Marketing Milk the author of the book discusses how a famous advertising campaign, Got Milk, for California Fluid Milk Processors Advisory Board, Kempab, became a success. 
To accomplish that, the author used the account planning process to develop a strategy that would remind consumers to purchase milk in combination with other foods. The campaign was tested on TV, billboards, and magazines, featuring images of typical everyday foods, such as chocolate chip cookies with a bite missing. The marketing campaign raised awareness of milk, making consumers more likely to stock up at the store. As a result, Kempab's milk consumption in California surpassed every other state. When the campaign launched nationally a few years later, it achieved similar success. By the end of this informative guide to the advertising industry, the reader will have acquired a comprehensive understanding of the indispensable role played by account planners. They will have delved into the intricate processes of consumer research, creating effective creative briefs, and refining marketing strategies to cater to the target audience. Also, they will have gained valuable insights into the significance of asking the right questions, prioritizing customer experience, and balancing communication between clients and creatives. Ultimately, the reader will appreciate what it takes to excel in account planning and create impactful advertising campaigns that connect with consumers on a human level.